Emily in the mines at 4.01 a.m. Hey everybody, welcome back to Cabin in the Woods. With yeah. Light a flare. Oh my god. Alright, Emma. Alright, let's go. Man, if only you had like a gun for that flare. <laughs> I think that whatever's in the mines here doesn't like, you know, fire. Okay. Because he had a flamethrower looking thing, you know? Yeah. But, uh,. Yeah, let's see. Let's see if we can keep this shit going, Alex. Let's see if you can keep everyone alive. Um, who's not already dead. So you killed clubs. two at this point. Yeah. It's better, though, because at the start of the session, she killed three people already, so... Mm -hmm. You killed <sighs> Jessica, and you killed Matt. Matt. Yeah. And we thought we killed Josh, but... Nope, you did not kill Josh. No. He's really not dead. Totem! Totem! Uh-oh. No, white's a good one, isn't it? Is that a white one? I didn't think it was fortune. Oh, it is fortune. Okay. Yeah. Looks like Mike holding a gun. Like... Someone and deciding not to shoot. That's what it looks like. Right? Because he's like, not man. Though, I will say, last time you found the fortune, didn't it tell you to shoot the, the hand over the, um... Yeah, it like did. Guidance. Yeah. Traveling through the mines. I wonder, so like for the fortune and guidance, is that just to Emily? Like is I don't, the fortune just for her? I don't believe so. Actually maybe. That would be the only thing that makes sense. Why else would it tell you not to shoot yourself as Chris? I mean, although what would the difference really be? Like he doesn't shoot anyone yeah. either way. Okay. Okay, yeah, I don't know. I don't really trust those things. So I'm pretty sure it told it to hand over the flare. And that's basically uh, what golf So killed. either of them can be correct. Both of them can oh, have use for the flare. I guess. Um, because I was... Shit! Wrong button. Oh, that's creepy. Yeah, that's a bad time. Gollum from the fucking Lord of the Rings over here. is precious. Did you pick a direction? Or did you yes. not? Okay. I guess it just, that one's like a fake choice because no matter which way you pick, don't go towards the thing. Alex, sometime today. I'm trying. Yeah. No pressure, but. Oh, God. I wish that I stayed with that other guy now. Oh, you didn't have a choice. I know. But I wish like he was near me because he's got fire and that seems to scare the thing. Or an or something. It's right there. Oh, it's right there. Listen up. Yeah, I'm afraid to move when. Uh... I like stop breathing. Yeah, I, I I did too. Oh. It's good use of a flare. Mm -hmm. So this is where I got Matt killed, by the way. Oh God. Uh, we'll explain afterwards because this is there's more of this. Yeah. Oh. 
it's not here. Oh, did she just have to avoid that entire segment? Or did that get her killed? I actually don't know. I'm not messing with you. Yeah, I was gonna say, don't take your time with that shit. I had to see how to how to show me how to do it. Yeah, if you fucking. And this is the day you almost caught Captain Jack Sparrow. Okay, so if you stay on, there's a segment with like a meat grinder, and if you fuck up, she gets cut, like she loses half of her body. Oh. And dies, presumably. What, on that conveyor belt thing? Yep. There's like an ore grinder or something. And I felt that there would be something like that when she first climbed on, and I was like, I'd rather not be on the one that's moving, just in case. Yeah. Also, she's severely fucked up. She got bit. Did she actually? Yep. Yeah, you got bit through the neck. Okay. On the neck. It'll show in your, um... In your butterfly effect. If Emily has the flare gun, she can prevent uh, that from happening. No. Oh. <laughs> That's why I say, like, both of them have use for the flare gun. If Matt had it in the mines, he would have been fine. So if he jumps, then he doesn't need the flare gun. Oh, hey. Crap. What now? Let her in quick. Shut the door, oh my god, shut the door! Emma, Emma, are you alright? I didn't think that I'd make it. You were screaming bloody murder. Are you okay? You look totally fine. There was something. Where's Matt? Come sit down, sit down. Something's out there. Did you guys pull it off? A monster is involved. Wait. Yeah, you know, I'm gonna be concerned. Are you okay? I'm fine, I don't feel anything. I just need to calm down. It was moving so damn fast. What? I just had to get away. Wait, what? There, there was this, this thing, whatever it was. Em, Em, you can relax. Josh was messing with us. You're not listening to me. You don't care about where Matt is? I don't care about Matt. It's Matt. fine. Because he's dead. Tell you. We were climbing up the tower, and it it fell. The whole tower just fell right into the mine. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What mines? There are these mine shafts all over, running under everything. When the tower fell, we ended up down there. I don't understand. The tower fell? How'd it fall? I, I was walking down there in the mines, and it was dark, and I found this pile, and there was Beth's head. Wait, what? Beth's yeah, I missed all that. Oh, it. my God. What the fuck? Are you serious? Yes, I'm serious. I think they fell down there. Oh, Jesus Christ. But the worst part is I don't think that Hannah died, like, from the fall, not right away. Wait, what? What do you mean? I don't know. I feel like she was down there, like, starving to death for weeks. When we were all up here looking for her, we had no idea. Jeez, that's horrible. Listen, in, Exposition. in the tower, there was there was a radio, and, and I got through to someone, but then that was right when the tower collapsed. Em, you made it. Oh, God, yeah, yeah, Mike. Oh, man, you guys are both single. Are what you going to get back I'm together? Out. <laughs> yeah, there, there was a monster that was chasing her. I, she's all messed up, guys. Emily? Hey, Em? Whoa. Fucking that be. Josh. Jess. It's not Jess. <laughs> it's not Jess. Mm. <laughs> Who is it? I don't know. We should check it out. She was missing half of her head. <laughs> it's just Jess. Just oh, I'm perfectly fine, guys. <laughs> she just shows up and she's just like Snowball oh, fight. <laughs> snowball fight. <laughs> <laughs> Me and Mike. Like the spitters from fuck. Left of Dead. Is that the Pick one. Uh, let me have the pistol, because I mean, you could take whoever it is through sheer good looks and muscle and all that. Because I'm going to choose not to shoot I, I the dude. I have the pistol. Because remember, he goes to shoot and he doesn't? When you put it that way. Okay, that's an instinct. Don't shoot yourself in the foot. I can respect that. Don't shoot right. yourself in the foot. Get that's a good shot. thought, actually. I didn't think about that. No, you can't. Oh. Yes, you can. Okay, everybody, just calm down. Now, just move over there. Go on, move. Let me say what I came to say. I'm here to tell you what you're up against being back on this mountain. You should never have returned. 
I don't know why you did after what happened last year. You mean with Hannah and Beth? Yeah, how could you know without being involved? Our response he, he was there. Hold on to your horses. I don't take kindly to you kids coming up here to my mountain. Your mountain? Huh? I'm sure the Washingtons would be very surprised to hear that. <laughs> well, the mountain don't belong to me, it's true. But it don't belong to the Washingtons. It belongs to the indigenous people. Belongs to the Wendigo. <laughs> Who? What's he talking about? What the hell's a Wendigo? Let's hear him out. Because it's from indigenous like people's choice. lore. Yep. It's I'm actually up in the Washington, Vancouver area. It doesn't matter to me if you believe it or not. I got reasons I want to get it off my chest. See? I told you. It's like an episode of Supernatural. Shit. Guilty as something. Shut up, Mike. There is a curse that dwells in these mountains. Should any man or woman resort to cannibalism in these woods, the spirit of the Wendigo shall be unleashed. Oh, crap. <laughs> Find somewhere safe. The basement might be okay. Okay, get down there now, all of you, and wait. What? Why? For how long? Until dawn. No, that's the name of the game. I ran off and left Josh when I heard screaming. Where did you leave him? In the shed. Uh, your friend will already be dead. Oh. Sorry, Josh. No, he can't be. We, we were just with him. A lot can happen quickly on this mountain. No. I'm gonna go get him. You can't go out. Chris, no. I'm supposed to be his best friend, and, and, and I let him down. No, he let you down, Chris. He let all of us down. I don't care. I'm going to get him. No, you're not. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you don't have a choice, Alex. I, I don't need your help. You Take the stranger. It's suicide. All right. The rest of you, get down to the basement. Be safe. Don't go outside again until we're back. Chris better survive, that's all I gotta say. You don't seem to understand the magnitude of the situation. Well, I'm going to get Josh, aren't I? No, I'm going to get Josh. You're going to help me. Do you understand? Uh... Yeah, I think so. You need to follow me and do everything I tell you. We so still got this guy who like knows what he's doing. Wendigos are scared of the like they can't be out, like with the light and stuff. Yeah, that's, that's why, why fire works against them. Yeah. See, I knew this man would probably turn out to be okay. And the flares. Yeah. This is the end. You point towards the thing you want to kill. I know how to use a shotgun, man. No, you don't. <laughs> how do you know? Trust me, I know. <laughs> like, look at him. Black eyed Ashley. So, so, so tell me, you're the expert on these things. I, what's uh? Check your oh, oh, yeah, shit. I want to look yeah. at all this shit. Okay. Point blank. Chris didn't speak to. Oh, Ashley didn't speak to Chris as he left. Yeah. Sorry. Well, Ashley. you shot him. Emily was bitten. Okay. Forewarned is forearmed. Chris and Josh. Okay. I can see that. Uh, we can save Ashley. She was grateful. And Josh felt betrayed. Betrayed. Oh, Chris considered violence. Okay. Yeah, he's he's not. Uh, he's ruder to Mike if Chris chooses to kill Ash, kill Ashley, even though it still goes towards Josh, because Josh understands what the choice that Chris made. Mm -hmm. He rigged the saw blade to go towards himself, no matter what. Yeah. But obviously, Chris's intention is what matters to Josh at that point. Okay, so if Chris. Try to send it to Ashley, then he seems a lot better to Josh because he's like, oh man, he tried to save me. Yeah. Is that what that is? Yeah. Emily gave the flare gun to Matt. Emily has no defense against the attack and was bitten. Oh, sorry, Emily. Yeah, I like that the next one's called Once Bitten. Oh, there's nothing with Ashley. Fuck. Well, you tried to shoot her. Fuck. I was trying so hard for them. Yeah, that relationship is, uh, is dead. Is dead. Nobody is in a relationship now. Maybe Mike and Emily will get back together. They used to date. Okay, so we made that up. 
set up his psycho story. Yeah, a lot of these are... It was Josh's voice. There was never an escaped convict. There was no psycho, obviously, because it was Josh. Which is how it could have gotten back there. Yep. Uh, newspapers faked to back up a psycho story. Yep. These must have been the when, uh, Wendigo sightings the mystery guy was collecting. Okay. Because you think that it goes to the psycho guy, but it's not. It's actually the other guy. Yep. Yeah, Josh took those. Josh was going to upload all this to the internet. Yeah, yeah. And put the axe there as part of his plan to freak his friends out. What's the guy gotta know? You just be careful. You follow my lead. I mean, you never know. The relationship could get better if maybe. How many times do I, have to shoot something I try and happens. save her, and I'm being heroic yeah. and going I mean, out to get Josh. It's dead. It's just right now, it's not good at all. This thing won't even kill it. Yeah. No, it'll slow it down. But how do you kill it? They don't like fire. I don't like fire. They fear it, and it can kill them if you have to. And their skin is like it's like tough armor. Unless you burn. Yeah, it's a little unfair though, because I actually asked for him to kill her. Yeah, that's true. Like, well, you could have also chosen to do nothing. I know, but it shouldn't be dead. But I thought that the saws would kill them both. That's why I wanted to act. Yeah, sure, I understand. I mean, can you figure out what they're gonna do? Well, they adhere to some pattern, like any animal. They come out every so often to kill people. Like how? Like they've got schedules. Well, they only hunt at night. Oh. Why? I didn't ask. <laughs> Sassy. Any uh, pro Wendigo tips? Like if I rub garlic all over me, they won't be able to smell me or something? Uh, they'll still smell you. <laughs> Anything like that? <coughs> they can't see you if you're standing still. It's like time. That's why Emily survived with the dumb move. Yeah. It's like that with like T-Rexes so and stuff. I, I'm, I'm basically <coughs> No. Unless you have no other choice. Oh, Josh is gone. Oh, no. Damn it, what happened? Oh, he's gone. We're too late. Shh, quiet. We gotta go. Right now. We gotta find Josh. He can still be out there. <laughs> First. Gross. And he keeps you alive and aware and feasts on your organs. One. I mean, he didn't do that to Jessica or to Matt. So go watch that. Well, we don't know where their bodies are, though. No, but they're not alive. You might still no. be here. Matt died when he was impaled. Jessica died. Yeah, I was just thinking that. Chris, hurry up. Chris. Chris, please. <laughs> this is not the time to look for clues. Don't move, Kyle. I'm stopped. I went six seven. Ooh. Nice. Oh. Sorry, I was in the middle of moving too. Okay, so. Run! Go! Now! Now! Back! Back! God damn! I'm right out in the open. Gotta get out of here! Did he just let us throw? Oh, you gotta grab the fire thing. You gotta. It's on a backpack. Just drag the body. Shit. No, that's. I should have shot the fire thing. It would have exploded. Oh, yeah, goddamn. Just... Those things will still stun them. Shit. Oh, Fuck. shit. I hit it too late. I don't know if that killed you or not. I don't think it did. I think that if you miss oh, that, you avoid man. having to take the shot afterwards. I think is what happens. Oh, shit. It's so creepy. It's like... Good shot. Oh. 
I was say, you know that works. Yeah, I don't know about the other Ash, one. Ash, come on, this thing is right behind me, please! Let me in! Ash. Ashley, no, don't let him die! What are you doing? <laughs> Ashley! <laughs> Okay. So when you shot her, you killed him. Fuck. He was already Ash. dead. Yeah. You know what, Ashley? You're a fucking bitch. Chris! Fuck! She literally asked fuck? for him to shoot her and then killed him that way. It wasn't too late, Ashley. You gotta go. It's too late. Like now. Okay? He went out Stay there me, to Ash. try and save a friend and you just. Come on. You just Stay with me. suck. <laughs> <laughs> so right before this episode, everyone, Chris and I both knew that Chris was already dead, uh, and we were like, so Alex, who's your, like, favorite? Like, if you, at the end of the game, had them all lined up, and you said you could only pick one to save, who would you pick? She's like, oh, Chris. I like Chris. And I'm like, great. <laughs> He's already dead. That's it. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my God. What took you so long? It's not good up there. What? What do you mean? Chris is, uh, not coming. Oh no, I can't believe this. Ash, I am so sorry. Okay. Maybe you I'm, should I'm, sit I'm down. I'm fine, Sam. Okay. okay. What about. Yeah, she's a lot more die. upset no, if no. you I die on the trail. Really? His head literally <laughs> rolls towards the door. Gross. She's like in tears and stuff. Right. Yeah, or if you yeah. actually try to save her, she'll let him in, obviously. What? But if he dies on the thing, she's like hysterical. Mike, mm. I really don't think that's a good Because if she, basically if she would have opened the door and he doesn't right make it, she gets really upset. Dawn. Yeah. At least we're safe down here. Oh, yeah? All wrapped up like a little present with a bow on top? That thing to tear us apart on Christmas morning? Well, I don't care what anyone else is left now, so... You don't sound so sure. What about Sam? Sam? Kill them all. What'll happen, right? Yeah, what about Sam and Mike? Yeah, I, I mean, right? I mean, I think Sam's wait. okay. I'm leaving. Mike, there's no key for the cable car. Josh. He's gotta have it. Josh? Yeah, it's but they can't place. find him. Great. Great. That fucking thing got a hold of Josh. Then, we're shit out of luck. Just hang out here till dawn, and possible. you're all fine. What's possible? It may have taken him down to the mine. What? I saw some horrible stuff down there. I think it's where that thing lives, and... Huh. M. What? Fuck it. I'm gonna get that key, right from that thing's goddamn bedroom, and then I'm gonna get us all the hell out of here. What is all that? It's uh, that old guy's bag. Is that a map? <gasps> that guy was prepared for anything. <laughs> Not quite. What is this place? Oh my god. Wait, wait, wait. What is that? I was down there. It was horrible. You were? You have been a cave in in the 50s, I guess, and these miners got trapped down there. Oh my god. There was this reporter, and I think he figured out there had been some, like, big cover-up going on. I found these plans. They knew the mine was a death trap, but they let the miners keep working anyway. And I'm not sure what it means, but I found this chair. Dried blood all over the place, like somebody had been tortured. Michael, I'd like to maybe focus on how we're gonna get the fuck out of here, please. I'm just saying, it's weird how much crazy shit's gone on up here. What's weird is that there's a tunnel leading from the lodge to the sanatorium, see? That's how I got back here. I saw this when I was down there. That's where it lives. Um. Um, what is th Huh? What is that? Ash. Um, oh my god, oh my god, It's, oh it's my nothing, god. it just, it, oh no, it oh bit no. me and- It bit you? What bit you? The, the Wendigo. What? It's nothing, really, it's not a big deal. You okay? Shit. It doesn't hurt anymore, really, it's- it's not that bad. Em, if that thing bit you... I, I know what you're thinking, and I'm fine. Are you? Yes. Emily, at least let us check it out. Emily, if the Wendigo bit you, you could turn into one of those things. Oh, that's ridiculous. Is that how that works? He said it was from eating each other. Remember, he said oh, that. Is that how it worked? Yes. It happens. If it bit you, you're going to turn into one, and then you're going to turn on us. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Sure brought that flare gun. Here with us. What? Mike! You gotta go. Are you kidding me? You're putting us all in danger. Like hell I am! Emily, you can't stay here. Mike, just cool your head, okay? We don't know if it works like that. Maybe it's just a bite. What 
is this? Guys, what are you doing? Door's right here. I am letting you do this voluntarily. I wonder what Chris would say oh, if he no, was here. You're just making yourself feel better about sending me to my death. <laughs> I'm so upset There's he's a dead. Okay. Out there ready to rip me to pieces like it did with. Okay. Oh my God. Will you just go? Go. Get out of here. Whoa. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Mike, calm down. You're, you're gonna shoot me. I wonder like if this was the me? gun thing. This if is the speaking. safe room, M. Please. It is not safe as long as you're in it. Not for us. Don't, don't do this! I'm really sorry. I don't want to do this. Then don't do it. Make your own she, choice. I hope she doesn't turn and end up uh, eating all of us. Oh, I can't do this. Oh, you did the right thing. I hope you did. Oh, wait, no, it was with him. Maybe. <laughs> because now. he's the one who had the gun. Yeah. I did the, I did the right thing. Keep an eye on her. You maybe. It was a fortune weird. one. Yeah, maybe. You guys know what to do. Yeah. No one leave. You can also have been saying, okay. don't leave Mike with the gun and that there. guy knock on the door. I'll be back soon. Uh, no, no, the two choices with, uh, with that thing were Chris demanding he give him the gun or suggesting he give him the gun. Chris always takes the gun at that point. And then gives it back. Good thing he gave it back, because he doesn't have a lot of use for it now, does he? Alex. Kyle. I thought that that he was going to help us. With a flamethrower, dude? Now we don't have a chance. No, guys, it just means we've got to be tough. Well, I hope that Emily Gotta doesn't do turn and kill game. everyone else who's in there besides Mike. I don't know if I can. Mining disaster. I mean, I can't read any of this, but we'll go back. Was there more or no? No. So, cannibalism causes the curse. Only few men have dared to hunt the Wendigo. I'm the only man who's ever kept them under control. Heed these words, or it shall be your death. Your death will not be the last. The Wendigo must be contained. So it grows out of cannibalism when a human is desperate and craves food, trapped on the mountain in the fierce winter storms. When he has eaten nothing for many days, the Wendigo spirit will begin to possess him. Even the strongest man's weak to it. He will kill without remorse, often those companions who, will, who have traveled with him. He will eat the flesh raw from the corpses. I've seen this happen many years ago, a craving for flesh that cannot be sated. And then the change begins. The eyes turn first and become milky and white. Then the teeth become longer like fangs. The creature grows and the skin is pulled taut across the bones. Gross. It's pretty gross. Uh, so, history of the mountain. There was a tribe that lived in these mountains, the Cree. Uh, the shamans tell stories of a tall creature born in ice. The tribe respected the mountain and all the animals which lived on it. The mountain became sacred to the Cree. Every animal became sacred also. The Cree believed it was bad luck to harm an animal on the mountain and would hunt elsewhere. In uh, 1983, the miners arrived. 1893. 1893, sorry. Uh, the miners arrived. They found tin and later traces of radium. They mined deep into the sacred mountain. Uh, the Cree say that the mountain cried out and the spirit was released. So how to fight and trap them. Um, so their eyes change. They become both sharper and more dim. The Wendigo sees movement. It is a hunter like a hawk, but it cannot see stillness. If you are to keep totally still, then the Wendigo will not be able to see you. Uh, the skin and flesh of the Wendigo are hard like armor. They seem to feel no pain. They cannot be cut or stabbed. Bullets will not pierce their skin, though a shotgun will keep them at bay. Yeah, well, we know that one. Yeah. Chris taught us that before he died. Kyle. Because the one who goes mutated from a human and knows how to hunt us, it can perfectly mimic its prey. It must remain sharp and disciplined. I've killed six one to goes. Can perfectly uh, mimic its prey. Yeah. Knives or bullets will not harm them. Use a flamethrower. It is the best weapon. Fire envelops them, burns away their skin, and makes them weak. But try not to kill them. Uh, killing one to go should be the last resort. Death releases the one to spirit into the air. Uh, I've contained them. I use traps to catch them and fire to drive them into cages. The traps were baited with human limbs from those who had no further use for them. Uh, one by one, I caught those who had infested the mountain. So he has them, like... In cages? Somewhere? He has to, because otherwise they death doesn't work. Yeah. Okay, so the bites. 
Uh, there may be defenses, shamans wrote of rituals. I found native artifacts on the mountain and copied them. Totems, bunches of herbs, and feathers. Uh, I copied their designs. I have tested them. Out on the mountain they work. They keep the uh, Wendigo at bay. Not entirely, but enough. Uh, but inside buildings they do not work. Oh, how oh great. Okay. Uh, Cree legends say that the Wendigo grows from the bite of another Wendigo, but the bite is harmless. I have been bitten, but I did not change. The only way is to eat the flesh of another. There is no other way. So yeah, not shooting Emily. Right decision. Right decision. Okay. Yeah, because that gun. Oh, that's, that's the same. That's one. the same one. Yeah, yeah. Ashley's going to tell or. Um, Ashley oh, knows. No, 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 what? No, no. What is it? What does it say? It says that. The bites. It, if it bites you, it's not infectious. It doesn't do anything. As long as she doesn't eat a person. She's yeah. fine. Let me see uh, that. I'm sorry, what did you say? Um. So she'll be okay? It says what? You're gonna be fine. They're fine? Like, Michael almost shot me, is that she fine? Didn't shoot you. And this bitch almost let him. Hey, that's not fair. She was scared. I'm the one who's scared. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Emily. I didn't know what was going to happen. There's None of us know. There's no excuse. There's no excuse for Emily, this. please, just try to understand. Understand the palm of my hand, bitch. Oh. <laughs> Emily. Wait, you were mad at- which one are you more mad at right now? I, I don't like either of them. You liked Ashley right up until she didn't like Kristen. Ashley snaps. Shh, shh, shh. We've gotta get to Mike. Uh, let him let in. in. <laughs> Okay, we're doing okay. Yeah, been worse. Oh, Joshua, you should have listened to me. Because of your choices, people have died. I don't know which is worse, actively triggering events that lead to someone's death, or passively allowing a tragedy to occur. Because you couldn't lift a goddamn finger to help someone else. Remember last year, huh? How you left your poor sisters to die? You did nothing to help. Paralyzed by your own self-centered fear, while a reef threat was closing in. I don't know if I like Doctor Hill. You, Josh. It's always Doctor all Peter Stormare. Hmm. Your game has gone terribly. And your friends, like your sisters, have deserted you. You're all alone. He doesn't know that we tried to go back for him, though. No. Can you feel so the entire time you were in these sessions, you, it was, you were playing as Josh. Yeah. Because you never played as Josh otherwise. Yeah, that's weird. It's because you were playing as Josh the entire time. I never noticed that. Joshua, why did you hurt them? I mean... They didn't hurt you, Joshua. Not intentionally. They made a stupid mistake, and a terrible tragedy befell your sisters. We did not intend for that to happen. We just did. And they were sorry, at least, until you subjected them to your night of horrific torture. Let's hope that it's not too late for atonement. And that your friends, if they still are your friends, can save you from something even worse than death itself. Mike, Ash, oh, thank God. What took you so long? It's not good up there. Chris! Oh! oh. My boy. Gosh, I am so sorry. Okay. If I replay this, I'm totally letting him live. Maybe you should I'm, I'm fine. Duh. Okay. No Can one's ever dying on my next old guy. No, sorry, yeah, no. So I said, and then I gave Matt the flare gun, he wasted it, and I tried to save Emily because I'm being a nice guy. What are you looking for? Another way out. Mike, there's no key for the cable car. 
Josh, it's harder than you think it is to keep him alive. Yeah. Even if you know what to do. It may have taken him down to the mine. <laughs> um, what is that? Huh? This is the safe room, M. Please. Fuck, I can't do this. There's no way to keep everyone alive and also have everyone right. be in good relationships with each other. Mm -hmm. Because in order to keep Emily from getting bitten, oh, Matt gosh. has to have a shitty relationship with Emily. Um... And obviously, Mike and Emily have a very poor relationship with Mike points a gun at her. Okay, we're two hours to dawn. Yeah, because uh, your relationship with Emily is going to fall. Yeah, yeah. Um, we're going we're gonna to call this one here. I was waiting for us to get to this point, dear. Yeah. I can keep track of the timer. Okay. But next time, we'll... Uh, next time, we'll venture back to the Tantarium for the key. God damn it. Yeah. <laughs> but hey, at least he's alone with no backup. See you guys then. <laughs>